Well, would you looky here? It's time again. I, you know, I got way more support on that video than I ever expected to. Did not expect that whatsoever. And you all seem to love it. Now, I mean, some of the roasts were okay. Some of them weren't so great. But overall, I had, I had a good reception. I had some good reception. And I want to do it again. So we're doing it again. So I went ahead and asked some people for some OP.GG accounts. We got a decent amount, I'd say. And, uh, oh boy. I'm not quite sure who to start off with, but I'm going to go ahead and hit it. So if you don't know, we're going to go ahead and grab a whole bunch of my fans, OP.GGs, roast the accounts, roast the accounts, and uh, move on. Hell yeah. All right, let's start off with Kirby with the weird feet meme. Well, National Coming Out Day was only a couple days ago. I see you prepared yourself. I mean, if you want to spam Rise and be your own kind of like discount Bjergsen, that's totally fine. But I mean, they're not going to Worlds and neither will you. Let's see here. Queen... Lux is the main played character and always doing flex Q with someone named Yorha 2 b How much money is he paying you for nudes? Man, you keep playing Lee Sin, but like Lee Sin, you're just too blind to see it's not working. Oh, this is simple. Bronze 3, 41% win rate. You literally can't aim skill shots. All your champions are point and click. And the one champion that was point and click and turned into a skill shot, Warwick, you have a 20% win rate on. If it goes in a line, it's too hard for you. Ah, yes, I remember this guy. Hater of Bricky at I just hate Bricky. Hmm. Let's see what's wrong with you. Let's see. Holy shit. It takes a certain kind of fucked up person to have a 71% win rate as Teemo and a 29% as Cho'Gath in this meta. Roast me like a chestnut over an open flame pop of brick. Okay. Oh, okay. You're the kind of guy who, when someone calls you racist, you're like, I'm not racist. I play the black champions. Oh boy. Weebs. That's what we got here. Nope. I see a 33% win rate on Warwick. That That's all I need to see. Smurf in promos. Okay. Let's go ahead and look at that. Someone doesn't know how to use shotgun knees. Patiently waiting for my roasting with this picture of me. All right. I'm curious enough. Let's see what we got here. Why is the only person you have a positive win rate on Garen? Okay, I guess a little bit of karma, but it's Garen. 33% win rate, bronze 3, 1 LP. You're not going to play any more ranked, are you? Nope. Thomas had never seen such a mess. Okay. Fucking learn how to shotgun knees. Why do you have a higher win rate on Aatrox than you do on Urgot? Oh shit, that's right. There's a, there's a subreddit for Urgot mains. I wonder if there's anything on, from me, like... If there's any kind of stuff from me. Oh, well, there I am. What do the comments look like? Hell yeah. Oh, maxing W. But everything else sucks so much ass. Was having a good run, now having a bad run. Roast me, Ricky. Nars Boomerang is your ELO. You gotta learn to catch that shit, man. You won't do it. Oh yeah, JT? Hey, I'm not gonna do it to you? Ooh, there it is. Over a thousand games, and you still don't know how to triple barrel. Maybe you spent less time jerking off Castle like this is Season 3 again. You might be getting out of Platinum 4, but no, 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 no. Looks like you're stuck here with someone like me. Damn, dude. I can see you're really taking your job seriously as the training dummy in the practice tool. Lex Q over Solo Q. Translate from French. Could not translate tweet. Let's see if I can translate your profile. Oh man, you're the worst kind of support. You're the kind of support that immediately wonders where the fuck my AD carry is when they're at 25% health with no summoners. You're the kind of guy who flashes, W's over a wall, and then use your ultimate as Rakan to try to charm four people on the enemy team while the rest of your team is waiting for 30 gold back in Fountain and you wonder why there's no follow-up. Let me guess, the nerf to Rylize was completely unwarranted and it should be put back into its original state. You're the kind of person who'll be seven and one as Jace and one v one as zero and 13 support. And when you kill them immediately, you'll say, OMG, so easy. But the moment you give up first blood, you AFK mid. Let me guess, you're actually the Rain Man in disguise. One, two, three, four, five ranked solo wins as Kennen. <clears throat> Twat, watching streams, all right? Watching streams, oh! Oh, stick to watching. With 1,000 games this season, it would seem like the amount of great win rates you have equivalizes to the amount of great time spent during your games. 600 games as a support main in silver, and the only person you have a legitimately high win rate as is Harvey Weinstein the tree. I see Vi. 
I see an average of 22.6 CS is Vi. You're a disgrace to me. I'm an ADC main, so it should be easy as hell for the memes. Well, as the name Penile Solicitor says, oh, you're looking in the very wrong spot for a penis. You just insist that champions that don't build art and censor are still viable. <laughs> and then you realize the future is now, old man. That's a very angry cat. Why is that cat so angry? Oh, it's because you fucking suck. You know, Alex, I see you on my stream quite often. You didn't tell me you were like this. You have a positive win rate as Teemo and a horrendous one on every single character on your roster. You know, there's a great drink over on your daily uh, vitamin shop. It's called fucking cyanide. There's a lot of early signs of depression. Naming yourself Gin and Coke and then having a sub average win rate on Gin and having to resort to playing Graves. That's a sign of depression. Get help. They say people gravitate towards the champions they are most resembling to. You're the guy who doesn't put deodorant on during uh, Comic-Con, huh? The only thing you're good at is fisting and little girls. I'm gonna go ahead and put you on a list. Greetings from Germany, Bricky. <laughs> Greetings from the dumpster. Dr. Popola King. I can, in fact, milk those. Ooh, TSM logo, Diamond 5, 0 LP, sub 50% win rate, Yasuo, Oriana, Gangplank, Syndra, Darius, top amounts. Jesus Christ, when's your next chemotherapy session or you do not know yet? Hmm. Your only relationships have been long distance, haven't they? Oh man, you're the kind of guy who dates a gal, but then immediately keeps on trying to let on to fuck her sister. And you fail. A lot. Let's see. Five on Warwick. Five on Kindred. So you own ten tail butt plugs. Woo! Pantheon main. Pressing more than one button in lane is pretty hard, isn't it? Holy shit, based on your champion pool, you emit less pressure than zero gravity. And finally, as you can see here, being in Twitch's poisoners, the only thing you poison are your teammates' leak experiences. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching this episode of this little roasting thing. I thought it was pretty fun. I don't think it was as good as the first one. I had a little bit of hard time trying to figure out good roasts. Maybe I'm just not creative enough or I need more time to figure this kind of stuff out. But regardless, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and, uh, you know, do whatever the hell you want to do. I don't really care. You can follow me on Twitter because if you want to be roasted, that's where I pick it. It's from Twitter. So, you know, yeah. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.